Hello and welcome back to your own channel Indian Defense Analysis where we bring to you all the latest development happening in the defense sector. The Nilgiri class frigates also classified as the Project 17 Alpha are a series of seven guided missile frigates having displacement of nearly 6670 ton being built at an overall cost of 45000 crore rupees. Four out of seven frigates is being constructed by MDL and other three by GRSE. Five out of seven frigates of this class has already been launched. The sixth frigate is set to be launched on 17th August 2023 by GRSE. It is going to be the third and last Project 17A frigate under construction by GRSE. The delivery of four warships will commence from financial year 2025 onwards at a rate of one frigate per year which is under construction with MDL. The three warships which are under construction by GRSE are scheduled for delivery from mid of 2025 to mid of 2026. The Project 17A or Alpha frigates are the follow-on series to Shivalik class frigates Project 17 and are equipped with more sophisticated capabilities. The Project 17A are the most advanced frigates built by Indian Navy and it's because of two main features. The first one is its modular design and second one is its stealth. The P-17A frigates are the first major warship to be built using the methodology of integrated modular construction, a manufacturing process in which multiple modules or blocks of a vessel's hull are pre-assembled or pre-outfitted independently before being aggregated for final assembly. The frigate's design incorporates a significant degree of stealth and low radar observability. By the use of composite materials, radar absorbent coatings and low observable radar transparent technologies, the frigate also maintains a low infrared and low acoustic signature. The Project 17A uses a flush deck layout in which the deck has a uniform continuous layout from bow to stern which reduces its radar cross-section making it stealthier. As a part of its anti-surface warfare capability, the class features one 8-cell BrahMos anti-ship cruise missiles. The vessels are also equipped with one Automillera 76mm naval gun. As a part of its anti-air warfare capabilities, the class features four 8-cell VLS for 32 Barak 8 extended range surface-to-air missiles with two placed at the bow and two placed at the aft. The Barak 8ER, also classified as LRSAM, is an extended range variant of the original Barak 8. The new variant is expected to feature a range of about 150 km. As a part of the anti-submarine warfare capabilities, the frigate features two triple torpedo launchers for firing anti-submarine torpedoes. The class also features two RBU-6000 anti-submarine rocket launchers capable of firing anti-submarine projectiles to a depth of up to 1000 meter. It is also equipped with two anti-torpedo decoy system and four decoy launchers which presumably may be an STL Maris torpedo countermeasure system and the coverage anti-missile decoy launchers respectively. Each ship spans 149 meters in length and 17.8 meters at beam and displaces 6,670 tons. Each frigate features two General Electric LM2500 gas turbines manufactured by G Aviation and two MAN12528 STC four-stroke engines manufactured by MAN Diesel and Turbo in a combined diesel and gas that is CODAG propulsion configuration. The CODAG is a type of propulsion system for warship that needs maximum speed and is considerably faster than their cruise speed, particularly warships like modern frigates or corvettes. The Nilgiri class features ELM 2248 MF star 
AESA radar as its primary radar suite. It also features Indra LTR-25 Lanza surface search radar as its secondary radar suite. The frigate is also equipped with an advanced combat management system CMS-17A equipped with sophisticated data links for higher interoperability among the various other warships. The class is equipped with BL Hamsa NG sonar developed by DRDO. The Hamsa NG is a hull mounted active compassive integrated sonar system capable of detecting, localizing, classifying, and tracking subsurface targets in both active and passive modes. Just like Vishakhapatnam class destroyer, the Nilgiri class also features the Shakti electronic warfare suite to provide an electronic layer of defense. This was today's update. Please let us know your views on this in comment section. If you like the video, do not forget to like, share and subscribe. With this, I would like to say goodbye and Jai Hind. We will soon back with more interesting and amazing development happening in the defense sector.